So, we are ready to go kill people. Why do we want to kill people? Because they said derogatory things about us. And we must put hatchets into their brains. Yes, like that, Ross. Well played, Mr. Pirate Man. Well played. With your big strong arms. You should be strong arms. You're so adorable. Oh, little Rossington. You're so good. Alright, so Amelia's way down there. We don't gotta worry about her this turn. We gotta try to get down there, as I've said before, ASAP. Let's see what we can do here. Wow, this should nicely weaken this guy up. And honestly, I probably don't need to be raising Naimi because you get in us a lot quicker on this route, obviously, than you would on the other one. But I guess I'm kind of spoilerificing things here, so. One step at a time. Wow, look at that. Even with a spear, it's still 100%. Joshua's just amazing. Yeah, but there's a reason that experience was pretty abysmal. Alright, Kyle and Tina. Alright, Tina, go heal that silly billy of a girl. There we go. Magical horse my ass. That sounds kind of gross, truth be told. Um, what do we got here? So you guys are all on the run. We got two archers here we gotta take care of. What's your movement again? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, are you fast enough? You don't have any throwing weapons, so that doesn't really matter, does it? No, no, it sure don't. Oh, well. Let's, uh, let's not move people into the range of anything too bad. Okay, so we can do that. We can do that. She can do this. Can we do this? Can we maybe do this? Oh, you don't need to heal. Well, the hell with you, then. Uh, you can keep your iron axe on. I'm cool with that. And, uh, Gills, you've really got to get the lead out, buddy. Yeah, that'll be fine. Kyle's getting some serious sword raising skills. Too bad it won't matter for him in the long run. <laughs> oh, Kyle, you're amazing. Leveling up and doesn't afraid of anything. It's excellent. That, unfortunately, is not a very good level up, you silly arse. Yes, I say words I definitely think like silly arse. Alright, there you go. Use it. Abuse it. And uh, we'll get you down there, and uh, we'll call that a show. A gong show, as it were. Yeah, see, so we should be in prime can candidacy to go get her in a minute. Which is our goal. Well, that's not very nice, shooting Erica in the face to make the world a better place for you. I don't know if I'm really down with this. Yeah, the enemy had really has a lot of troops here, but they are what the French call le weak freaking sauce. Really? That's not going to kill that guy? All right, that's fine. You do what you want, Ross. There you go. Increased your weapon level. I guess that's something. Yeah, see, if you miss that, you could possibly die, but eh, whatever. I have faith you won't miss, Tana. Even if it was only a three out of four. Oh, my. Pegasus Knights. Frustrating at times to deal with, but fun to use, I gotta tell you. Alright, Joshua, how about you hammer this guy's face? Because he likes it. Nice. Ha, <laughs> you missed. You missed with your hands that have no fingers. Looks kind of weird. You thought he was wearing mitts, and it's like, how can you really be wearing mitts when you're fighting? That doesn't make any sense to me. Franz, can you talk to this silly girl? You can. Problem is, well, she'd be too much danger if I do that. It's potentially a, a, potentially a situation that we might be facing. Is there another axe wielder out here? I, can she reach if I do that? She can't, and there's only magic users coming. Alright, so let's do that. That's fine. He's got a steel axe, too. That, that guy had a slightly more dangerous weapon than what we've been seeing. Luke can kill to a heart's content. I'm fine with that. She's also fine with that. Ever, if you're not fine with that, then you're Osama Bin Laden, and Obama's coming to get you. That, that's all there is to it. Right, right, right. How about you guys? Alright, let's go talk to this girl. First of all, let's equip our sword. Wait, is he healed? He is healed. But do I have anything that can help him out magic-wise? Not really. Do I want to do that this turn? No, I can wait one more turn, actually. Uh, 
let's go over here and put on a javelin, because that's the smart thing to do. And we'll go here and put on a hand axe. And let her come down here and heal uh, Garcia. Oh yeah, see, there's there's a plan here. Basically, I'm gonna force those mages into trying to kill me uh, this turn. I'll take some damage, but if they're dead, that leaves it leaves it wide open to go after Amelia next turn. And we'll have everyone all lined up and rip Rarin ready to go. And uh, how about you? You've only got you got a vulnerary. Use the vulnerary. Make sure she stays healthy. We also got to make sure someone visits that uh, house before I forget about it, because I know me, I'll forget about it. Still taking seven damage. That's a little higher than I expected. Oh, she's got elf fire. That's why. Or he's got elf fire. Well, oh, I'm kind of hopeful that the other guy does not have elf fire, because if they do, not good news. Oh, I got an elf fire. So elf fire. And Elfar. Ha 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 ha! She eats your fire for breakfast. Excellent news for loot. Alright, who wants to go visit there? Uh Kyle can go visit there, because he is really diplomatic. Look who it is. Oh no. Um, so it gives us a dragon shield to up our defense. Excellent news. Well, that was quite the strange happening, but uh, them's the breaks, I guess. What you guys, where can you reach? You can reach there. All right. Friends, get down here. Make sure you got your sword equipped. And then talk to this silly girl. Uh, what, what? In the butt. Said what? What? In... Oh, wait, no. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing here? I'm Amelia. <laughs> really? You're my enemy? Yeah, I guess so. Ooh, Franz getting kanky. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, apparently you are his prisoner. Yeah, she is. That's because she, she lets her sword do the talking. But only after people trust you first, Franz, am I right? You untrustworthy bastard. Alright, Amelia. You get the hell away, because you are what the French call the weak freaking sauce and cannot be trusted. Alright, so that's where everyone can get to. And let's get everybody down here and get ready to march forward relentlessly. We have to make sure Loot is healed because we don't want to let her die accidentally. Although, people dying on this route, I guess, wouldn't be as bad because, hey, it's not the route where we're paying attention to. And people have asked me to uh, start using some other characters I haven't used, like stronger people. I'm actually planning to make more use of those people on this route just because they're pretty strong and it'll make my life a little easier. And there's nothing wrong with a slightly easier life. Am I right or am I right? And the answer is, I'm right. Alright, what do we got here? Got a guy trying to hurt us. Wow. My defense is terrible. Oh, that guy's dead next turn. He's dead, Burns. There's no doubt about it. Speaking of dead this turn. Wow, you actually hit me. Good for you, buddy. You did it. You did it. Alright. Garcia, can you actually hit this guy by any chance with your Iron Lance? Well, ah, three out of four. We'll take a shot at it. Nice. His intestines is all over the ground. The color stuff is boop. Oh, that was so gross, Brian. What the hell? Uh, no. We're not going to let you do that. That's just not a good idea. So that's why we're not going to let you do that. And we're just going to continue marching forward relentlessly here. And try to hurt people. Because that's what we're about. Hurting people. That dodge move looked really just kind of... Eh, I don't really want to work so hard in this dodge. So I'm not going to. Alright, how about the rapier? No. Ah, hit you with the iron sword. That's fine. Stabbed. Miss and stab. 
Nice. Sally O'Malley, sword fighting technique, ladies and gentlemen. And I wonder if anyone's going to get that reference. I don't know. I know someone who should, but if he does, and I at the same time, I wouldn't be absolutely uh, shocked either. Ooh, an axe reaver. That could be dangerous. Get you down here and heal the countryside. Man, she's getting all kinds of healing on this 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 take through here. This take through and this talk through. Which is better than a balk through. A balk through is some kind of uh, I'm assuming baseball terminology, honestly. And I might be making a whole bunch of that up. So now I'm in kind of straits here of direness because I don't want to put anyone out here who's super weak. But I guess we'll make do with what we can make do. There's only the two of them, and only, theoretically, they shouldn't be able to hurt us too bad, right? And they don't have throwing weapons, so... Let's get our, uh... Charging Chucks all ready here. Amelia, go hang out with those guys. Alright, let's do it. Bring it. Six damage, that's fine. And by six, I mean zero, because you didn't hit me. Tana says, thank you very much. You did. Nice. Nice. I cannot disagree with that assessment of attacks. And you missed as well. And your defense isn't as good as your partner. So I hope you, get in, hope you enjoyed dying, the two of you. Tana enjoyed the, the free experience, honestly. And Axe Reaver. Hooray. All right. We got a magic user and some swordsies and some archers, and then we are done. So, let's get the magic usery guy all lined up here. Make sure the swordsies aren't going to get me, and the archeries aren't going to get me, and no. So definitely we're fine. Hey, hey, cut that out. Uh, yeah, that's fine. She, she's doing really well, so we'll let her have some fun. What the hell? What the hell, as they say. Um, yeah, Garcia, you may as well try to get as much in as you can, because you're not really going anywhere else. And you can just go park beside Joshua for fun, and you can just follow the party here. Alright, let's just draw them out one at a time. We're all good in the hood with that plan. The reason I'm with Tana is that allegedly Pegasus Knights don't take that much damage from magic, and they don't when they dodge everything. And then throw, gee, she's just a merciless killing machine right now. Ridiculous. She's enjoying it, though. Not a very good level up. Disappointed in you. The levels up have been rather poor, all told. Archie boys. Archie boys. Couldn't the Archie boys do? That's fine. That's just Jim freaking dandy. Like sour freaking candy. Actually, let's just make sure these guys don't have any surprises in store for me. Nope, they just got reasonably good swords. That's all we gotta worry about. Perfect. Um, sure, let's do that. Let's do that. And if she gets shot and killed, whatever. I don't like her anyway. She smells. That's uh, probably not actually true. She probably actually smells like a beautiful rose garden. But I wouldn't know because I'm racist. And by racist, I mean I just don't give a shit to pay attention. You know, it's all good to have a plan. It just goes out the window the second you start to think about things. That's your pro tip for the day. Don't plan ahead. Alright? Oh, there's a support. We're all ready to go there. Of course, I just warp right through it like a fool. A fool bag, if you will. I didn't think I'd be fast enough to get the double shot in, but, you know. Alright. What do you got for a throwing axe? Actually, let's make sure we know what this guy's got. He's got a steel axe and a steel bow. He's just going to be a pain in the ass, isn't he? He certainly is. Well, that'll take care of those guys, right? All right. Um, how about you go where I'm telling you to go, you silly... Oh. Oh. There we go, much better. Hurt him. Oh, there's the critical hit. 
Someone was asking for her critical hit animation, and I couldn't remember the answer. Well, that's what it looks like. And Lucius just leveling him up like mad. Defense and resistance. All right. People who say they're not all about the re defense and resistance are dirty liars and should be ignored on all counts. Honestly. I wonder if that guy will come after me if I come over here. I don't know. Let's try to kill or lance the countryside, because that'll be fun. Oh, it didn't work. Poo. We'll get rid of that guy one turn quicker, though. That is a plus. Huh. Yeah, that should be fine. Everyone around 70%, you know, working their B, or C, depending on what grading system you're working on, I guess. It's always been a B to me, but apparently it works different in the U.S.? I don't know. You guys have to tell me. Can you hurt this guy with your hatchet? Yes, but you can't kill him, so that's no fun. Is anyone actually hurt right now? Like, I'm not really seeing it. Anyway, let's have that support conversation. I think we've already seen this one, yeah. Yeah. Good for you, Blondie. Ah, That's so nice. Yep. Saved a lot of lives out there, you know? Where will we be without you? You're special, see? Why is he talking like that? I have no idea. He's not talking like that. It's just me kind of doing up a voice for him. Nice smile. I wish he'd be a little more subtle with his I want to rape you sort of uh, talk, but uh, that's just how he rolls, I guess. He just doesn't want to deal. What happens if I do this again besides potential death? Potential death. Perfect. All right. Just meant to make sure I knew the plan. All right. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Killer, killer hit. Now, uh, if you're going to use a killer land shot, you may as well get the killer hit, right? Right, Kyle? Kyle? Bueller? So he's smart. At least he knew he could damage Franz a little more. Just a little more, though. Not much. Well, that is technically the right move. And by technically, I mean you're dead. But, you know. Learn and live. Or in your case, die and don't learn. Alright, we need to send somebody up there who's not going to be involved in the fight. That would be you. You're not going to be involved in dealing with this guy. Neither are you. You might be. Uh, you definitely are going to be. So we'll get you all set to go here. You've only got a crappy... Actually, I can trade. You've got a killing edge. You're fine. You'll be able to use your killing edge. Just Jim Dandy like sour candy. Garcia, you'll probably be involved as well. So. Oh, what the hell. Let him have a shot. Oh, he hit him. Good work. Wasn't planning on that actually connecting. But that's okay. Friends, you probably are also going to be involved in this bruja of the haha. -ha, so. You over there, Garcia, you're going to have to have some, well, oh, there's a support conversation, which we've already seen before as well. Oh, hi, Dad, what are you thinking about? Nothing, just maybe, what was Mom like? You know, like in a Chinese fortune cookie in bed? Um, I don't know, maybe you don't, whoa, okay, with the context I've given this, this conversation's taken on a whole new light. Um... Whoa, okay, now, I don't know if I want to read the rest of this conversation with that context anymore. I don't know. <laughs> um, okay, this is getting into some weird places, honestly. Um, she's dead, dude. She doesn't get lonely. Mm -hmm. You should have just dug her up and dragged her along. You could have had Weekend at Bernie's 3, Tokyo Drift going on. I may be mixing my movie metaphors. The two of you are going to rebuild a whole village. Crazy. Yeah. Show me what you got. All right, sure. And Archer, you might be able to help, but I don't know if you'll be able to deal enough damage, honestly. Uh. All right. All right, that's fine. 
He's just going to kind of look at us all funny and not move. He's just going to be like, hey, look at that mass of blue humanity coming to get me. So what do we save by saving this place? Yeah. Um. No. I, I love how that guy just changes his tone from, F you. That's what we saved. It was another rapier for her. So we can start wasting her rapier. Excellent. I knew there was a way to get another one. I just couldn't remember where it was or how it worked and electric boogaloo and all that fun stuff. All right. So let's do a little bit of testing after we heal and see who can do what damage to take this guy down. We don't want to give him too much of space or anything else. So if you went in here and attacked with an iron sword, you could only do 8 damage, but it's 100% going to hit. Garcia, you can do 9 damage, and it's guaranteed. But... Alright, interesting. How about you, Hatchet Man? Can you help out at all? Five is five, so we've got eight, and that's basically thirteen you can count on. Nine. Well, let's see if he. Yeah, that. See, that's huge. That's a third of his life right there. How about you, Archer Girl? Can you do anything to him? No. That's disappointing. Kyle should be able to do some damage. It just depends how much he can do. Twelve. All right, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. And of course, we've got a race in the hole here. Professor Killington, who basically could kill him on his own. Actually, let's, let's let Professor Killington take on Binks here. All right, Professor Killington, ready? Go. Damn, Green Warrior, pretty awesome. No, God, I should be worth at least 10. Well, that's too bad. Ah, oh, you missed. Still, that's going to set it up for a beautiful finish. Well, he's that one critical hit, and he's toast. Hey, Loot, you want to do it? No. Franz, no. Who wants to do the killer? Kyle, since you technically are the man of manning this here, you go ahead. Cut. Oh, that's got to cut deep. That that doesn't cut deep, though. That cuts very deep, and that's it for Binks. Pablo? Picasso? Oh, whatever. Kyle gets a level up. For free! Well, he did have to kill a man for it, but you know what I mean. Getting stats and stuff, he doesn't really need more in. Excellent. Uh, of course she is. No, God, no. <laughs> Seth with the burn. They suck. Wait here, I'll go kill the... Whoa, Seth, whoa. He didn't do, he didn't do anything bad, he just tried to kill you. Uh-huh. <laughs> Seth, oh, Seth. Pablo from the Council of Elders, huh? Yeah. Of course. Interesting. So that means we're now going to have to march through a territory where Pablo is hiring mercenaries to kill us. Yep. Of course they would. Oh no. That is bad. Oh look, a messenger. I'm sure this isn't going to be bad. Okay, maybe it's bad. Yep. Oh no. He's trapped in a siege. He has no means of escape. Yep. <laughs> Just run away. We'll take care of it. Sir Stobblechin. Burn! Everyone's just full of burns today. So many burns. You'd think it was like, you know, the burn ward at the hospital. Anyway. Continuing onwards here. Yay. Witless Ninny. That's a perfect description of her. And, yep. So we get an angelic robe. Some hit points for somebody. Hooray. Probably, I should probably give it to her to make sure she does not die. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. Join us tomorrow for Chapter 10 of Erica's Route. It is a map that is a little dicey, but a lot of fun. Join us then, won't you?